Hey, what's up guys? It's Zebra here, bringing you yet another Wi-Fi battle. And this one is going to be against Mufasa Fernando, and I can't quite remember which stream this is from. I think it might have been during ELO stream. So this is a standard match, uh, so uh, let's go ahead and get into this. He's going to lead off with the Venomoth, and I'm going to lead off with my Mew. And I'm going to go straight for the trick. Not knowing that most Venomoths usually like to go for Sleep Powder first turn, so... Shit. So my Mew is asleep, so that's not that great, but... You know, he is uh, Scarf, so he's going to be unable to set up Quiver Dances. So he's going to bring in a Registeel, but I get the first turn, wake up, and I am able to get the um, will o -Wisp off on it, and that's great. So um, his Registeel is burned, which really doesn't matter, because it mainly only has um, only has a Seismic Toss to really hit me with. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and transform, and he goes for the Toxic, which is great, because it doesn't affect me, because I'm Steel-type now. And uh, he paralyzes me with Thunder Wave, which is, you know, it's I can deal with that, and... Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and take this time to set up the uh, rocks of my own with his own poke. So, I'm going to go ahead and switch into All Smiles, because I know he's going to want to go for the Seismic Toss now, because he doesn't really have any other moves to hit me with, because, you know, I saw what moves he has, and his only other move was Seismic Toss, which was his main attacking move. So, he's going to bring in High Dragon, but uh, I'm just going to go for the safe Focus Blast, because, you know, I don't really want to overpredict right now, and Focus Blast is safe, but he brought in High Dragon, which is great, because that thing's going to be out of the way, which is pretty much a huge threat to my team. Now he's going to bring in his Espeon, but uh, he probably thought I, I was probably Scarf, but I am an Expert Belt Gengar, and I'm going to go ahead and hit that with the Shadow Ball, so that thing's going to be gone. Now he's going to bring in Venomoth, and now I'm thinking, yeah, he's probably going to go for Sleep Powder now, uh, just, you know, to try and put it to sleep, but uh, he just ends up going for the Bug Buzz, and, you know, I bring in my Crossel or Hermit, and, you know, it's a, it's going to be, I think, end up being a two-hit KO. Yeah, two-hit KO on me, because I don't have the Grave Special of Defense, but that's fine. Knowing that he is locked, locked into... Um, magic coat i'm gonna go ahead and just rapid spin just you know get those rocks out of the way because you know they'll be kind of annoying i thought maybe he'd switch but you know he decides to stay in so he's gonna go for another bug buzz and i'm just gonna go for that mirror coat and just smack him back with all of that damage that he just did to me which isn't much because i am especially defensive with max hp so that venomoth is gonna be out of the way now he's gonna bring in nidoking king and i'm not sure really what nidoking king can do to me so i'm gonna go ahead and protect and he's gonna go for the thunder and i was like holy crap that could have missed. So I'm like, alright, I'll just stay in, in case he wants to go for it again. But he goes for the home claws this turn, probably predicting me to switch, but uh, I'm just going to go ahead and hit him with Scald, and that's going to do uh, lots of damage, and it's not going to quite take him out, but pretty close. So uh, here he's just going to go for the Thunder, and, you know, I was like, alright, well, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to live, because, you know, Sheer Force and uh, Life Orb uh, boosted uh, Thunder will take me out. And plus, Thunder has a really high base attack. Whatever, okay. Hit it with Shadow Ball, dead. Aggron comes in, Focus Blast is coming. Because of the Stealth Rocks, the Sturdy is gone, so Focus Blast is easily going to KO. And then Registeel is his last poke, and Focus Blast might not take it out, but um, I'm not missing, and Focus Blast is going to bring it down to low enough to where um, Thunderbolt will just be able to easily knock it out, and pretty much because of the burn and all that. And he really has nothing to do to my Gengar, since you know his only attacking move was... Uh, seismic Toss. So that was a great game, Ufasa Fernando. It was relatively, actually, it was really quick and short. It was a really offensive game, but uh, that was a really fun match. Uh, there's a link to his channel. He's a really cool guy. He uh, does uh, he does Pokemon battles, but he doesn't really post it on his channel, but uh, he does uh, Pokemon TCG stuff. So if you're really into that, go check out his channel. Um, you know, if you like what you see there, just go ahead and, you know, give him a, uh, subscribe to him if you want. Um, so yeah, go check that out and all that other cool jazz. So uh, here's a link to... Uh, the last match that I uploaded, which was against, um, shit, I should have looked this up, um, I can't remember right now, um, oh yeah, Jose Tron, uh, one, Jose Tron one, yeah, this is against Jose Tron one, it was another standard match, it was, uh, it was still relatively quirk, qu quirk, it was relatively quick, but, you know, it was a fun match and all, but yeah, if you haven't seen that yet, go ahead and check it out, but, uh, another thing that I want to bring up is that, uh, you know, a good friend of mine, a guy who's been subbed to me since when I first started, and he just hit a 500 subs. This is uh, Chimpact. He just uh, hit 500 subs, and he uploaded a 500 sub special. So it'd be a great deal, of, uh, mean a great deal amount to me if you guys went and checked out this video. It is a really great battle, and as you can see, he's using a level one Magnemite, which is called Swagnemite, which is boss, and um, it, it actually does really turn out really well in this match, and it's a really great match to watch. So yeah, go go ahead and go check out his match. Uh, Watch the video, give him a like and all that, and if you like what he does on his channel, just go ahead and subscribe to him. He's a really cool guy, he's been there at the beginning when I first started uploading videos, so, you know, it'd mean a lot to me if you guys go ahead and, uh, go ahead and click and check out his match. It, it, it to me, the match, the match, it, it's, tough. it's pretty long, but it was a really cool match, because he he's using some really cool pokes in the match, and the match is 
actually it's pretty fucking awesome so yeah he's got the Cafagoras, he's got Swagnumite which is boss, Swagnumite puts in work and just like just destroys pokes so yeah um, just go ahead and click that and uh, you can check that out or you can wait till the end of this video because I got another another link after this video coming up because this, this ending is going to be ended kind of long winded but you know we can go ahead and get into this because he's going to destiny bond on this uh, or he's going to trick room and then destiny bond and all this stuff and it, it, it's it's a pretty cool pretty cool Fagra set so he, he's running some really really cool stuff on that so yeah if you haven't clicked it or if you, you haven't clicked it yet but uh, here's another link I, remember on my last my, my secondary channel I was talking about a Mario Party uh, let's play sorts of with other people and um, this is uh, my first upload with the Mario Party 6 uh, this was mainly a test video so I'm mainly playing against the computer but it was a lot of fun it, it went totally a different way than what I s expected it so um, click this uh, click the video and it will take you to my secondary channel where all five parts are up and you know all five parts are up and you can watch all five of them and you know I want check that out let leave some feedback for me let me know what you think because this is sort of my first let's play I've ever done so it, yeah it's like a sort of a let's play or let's party I guess you could say but you know there's a link to that you could check that out I'm the boo but um you can check that out and you know there's five parts it's it's probably roughly almost an hour in total length but it's it's a really fun watch I, I'm talking through the whole thing um, it's a live narration of when I was playing and just I swear a lot, but it's it's pretty funny. So yeah, if um, you want to check that out, you can click that, and it'll take you to uh, my secondary channel where that's at. So I'm gonna try and get the the whole internet or playing online with friends, and you know see how that goes. You know, ruin a couple of friendships that I made on YouTube. So let me know what you guys uh, think uh, about uh, that idea on my other channel. I really appreciate that. Also check out Chimpax Battle. All of these links will be in the description. There'll be a link to Mufasa Fernando's channel, the guy who I battled. Uh, in this video, um, a link to the last video, a link to Chimpak's channel, and a link to his video, and then there will be a link to my secondary channel and the LP channel, and then Facebook and Twitter. So that's gonna be pretty much it for today. I just made a quick, I just made a quick, uh, I just had a battle, and I was just like, all right, let's upload that, do a couple of quick, uh, you know, announcements or you know, video, uh, updates of some sort. So I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope I'm not rambling. For, actually, I am rambling for too long. So I'm gonna go ahead and just let the video finish playing off, and I'll catch you guys later. Cheers.